today we stand before this country in the capital of our country we stand before and we question whether democracy is prevalent or not in our state the state of andhra pradesh where the very word democracy means equitable just equitable justice and today in the state of andhra pradesh you have a scenario where equitable justice is denied where democracy stands limping that is the plight of affairs in andhra pradesh you have a government in place were within 45 days of coming into power you have a situation where more than 30 people have been murdered where you have more than 300 people on whom you have assault taken place which led to attempt of murder where you have more than 560 properties private properties vandalized where you have more than 490 government properties also vandalized where you also have more than 1000 cases more than 1000 cases where you have a situation of assault taking place private properties destroyed people walking into the houses destroying the properties within where plantations have been destroyed that is the plight of affairs in andhra pradesh in fact you have people like chandra babu naidu's son nara lokesh displaying a red book where he displaying a red book is actually captured in the form of hoardings and displayed all over the state and the contents in, and the contents in this red book are a list of officials a list of politicians on whom they intend to take action on whom they intend to assault and this kind of hoardings starting off with chandra babu naidu's son blatantly being displayed all over the state in andhra pradesh where you have a situation where you are where you are giving instructions to the police that our people would vandalize our people would kill our people would assault and there should be no action taken on them when you have somebody like nara lokesh chandra babu naidu sons holding this red book and this red book being captured in the form of hoardings now think about what kind of message it is sending now he starts off with a red book at the state level you have a similar kind of red books being displayed and vengeance being taken at everybody from the grassroots level at the village level now this is the plight of affairs now i like to question one thing today they are in power tomorrow we could come into power yesterday we were in power but when we were in power we had never propagated such kind of behavior we have never encouraged 